Before we begin day five, I would just like to say thank you to everyone who's subscribed and watched my video so far. You guys have just pushed me over 50 subscribers. It means a lot to me. And uh, But yeah, we're going to get into the video now. Okay, it's time to get rid of the super smelter. It hasn't worked, but you ready? See the bug? I'm just going to open this. See how it didn't open? And now I am spamming the open inventory button on my controller. And uh, as you can see, no inventory is popping up. And if I go to any chest now... They open on screen, but I cannot access their inventories. Uh, so now I have to log out and log back in. Please fix this bug, Mojang. With the hideous, not useful super smelter gone, I have laid out a pathway from the nether portal to this overlook I made over here. Gonna have a water elevator up and down to the beach, because people were complaining they couldn't get up easily. I could have just put in a staircase, but <laughs> no, 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 no. We got we, we got to do something a little bit better than a staircase. I'm thinking like a waterfall to hide the elevator, and uh, let's see if I can pull it off. Okay, now you can see the rough idea I was going for. Just a uh, column of water to hide the entrance to the elevator. I still need to do some more work, as you can as you can see. It's just literally the a line of water with a hole in the wall, but uh, it's just to show you the idea. I gotta connect it to the cliff better, and I got you gotta do the water elevator that I'm building this massive thing to hide. So uh, maybe I could have uh, did that first, but uh, you know, I I'm gonna get to it. Oh yes, from way out here you can see it in its beauty. It adds a little to the, it adds a little bit to this cliff face, makes it less plain. Uh, but uh, let us sleep before the admin gets angry. Okay, I'm back, and as you can see, I've uh, tried to add, uh, merge it to the cliff a little bit better. And I uh, just don't mind Agent Kitty bragging that she has shulkers, and uh, focus on my nice handiwork. I, I tried to use a lot of mossy stone. I, I, I think that uh, adds to the realism. You know, the water's going to create foliage. Science. Okay, let me show you this thing in action. You just, you just walk through this pond that I have to add a... Uh, a walkway over and uh, I still have to do the interior in here but uh, at least it works now you can just take this all the way up try not to get stuck on the trap door and uh, there you go now you're up here at the overlook I just added some lanterns and some diorite fence people uh, gagged when I told them about it but uh, you know diorite can be useful you just drop down here to go down walk out past the waterfall swim through the pond hopefully you have depth strider and uh, yeah what do you guys think Nice, ain't it? We are not at spawn for once. We are at the land I claimed. While we're not moving yet, I figured I'd give it a week at spawn, living with the others. I am over here to start construction on a storage room, so when the move is time, I will be ready. I have laid out the rough outline of my storage room. There's going to be three little sections of a 3x3 three three chest. So, um... Nine chests per per section and uh, 27 chests total. And I just gotta lay in the floor, do up the walls. I haven't built the building around the storage room yet. That's I'll probably move in before I do that. But uh, as you can see from standing in one of these uh, modules, you can reach all the chests. So uh, that makes it because the thing about storage rooms is you you try to keep them compact, or, or else you have to run all over your base to put stuff away, and that's that's no fun. Just came back to spawn to use uh, the admin's smelter um, furnaces, and he uh, he seems to be harvesting trees with a pickaxe. They're very odd people on this realm. I, I don't know about them. He's camera shy, I guess, and doesn't want to do what he did. Okay, I need another right, so I thought I would work on my tunnel, and um, as you can see, I've laid out the ice kind of. I uh, mis misjudged it the first time. I was gonna do a uh, an even amount of ice because you know the portals are too wide but uh this was supposed to be on the other side so uh i've kind of mined out one block like the wrong way so now you have to mine even more blocks like this is turning into a project okay uh, i've been busy and uh i like the middle section the middle four blocks i'm gonna keep the uh the outside with grass um I need to find some TNT and uh, pretend I didn't make that mistake. I did not. I did not try that design. That was never there. Don't look at it. 
Is this what people do when they say they're caving? It's, uh, it's not enjoyable. Uh, no, oh, no, no, I, no, well, anyways, let's, let's get more coal. This is a much better form of caving. Now, when I say I'm caving, I mean I'm, I'm making a cave. And as you can see, I've, uh, I've uh, laid out the rough perimeter, and uh, it's hard to it's hard for me to explain what's going to be, but there's going to be a pond there, and I've just laid out the where the walls are going to go, but uh, but but you'll see it. I'll, I'll get to work. The cave is coming together. I've, I've laid out the floor, as you can see. I only use five blocks: um, cobble, mossy cobble, tough dirt, and uh, what's that? Uh, Podzol, I think. You know the dirt that's under the spruce trees. And I, I think it came out very, very nice, very cave looking. Like you see this texture and, and you can just tell it's a cave. But I have to do the walls and the roof. I got to put in decoration. So uh, I'll check back in with you in a bit. Hmm. Uh, Beedon seemed to log in right right on my lawn, right above the where I'm working on the cave. So uh, naturally I uh, mined uh, the blocks out from underneath him before he could join. So now we just sit here and wait for him to fall. Any second now. Any day now. He he has the same Wi-Fi as me apparently. It takes him 18 years to load in. Hey, I don't think I don't think he's logging in today. This, this was a this was not a fruitful endeavor. This is time I could be spent working on the cave. Instead, I am uh, just uh, looking up at the admin. I mean, that is what he said he wanted us to do when we joined. Look up at him. Admire him. Worship the floating god. The one true deity. We are not worthy. Alrighty, I have uh, finally finished it. Are you ready? Are you ready for the tour? Are you ready for the great tour of the, uh, the cave? You can almost see my house. You can see the cherry blossom, but... uh. I really should put a path for my house down here, but uh, I like adding the water and uh, the, you know, you just just taking its beauty. Oh, it's glorious! And I still have to add. I have to add a few things. The work is never done. Maybe I can uh, convince Ted to come uh, fix what I, the few flaws I have uh, done. But I, I went with the uh, the blue little grass, the crimson, whatever it's called. As I, I feel like that would fit. You don't want regular foliage growing in your cave, but uh, that's going to do it for this episode. Top side out.